We're going to do a brief video on Tesla stock, TSLA, Tesla stock analysis. And we're going to show you a, a, a chart of Tesla here with a five day moving average in green, a 20 day moving average in red, and a 200 day moving average in blue. We're going to show you an hourly, daily, weekly, and monthly chart of Tesla to show you how Tesla is breaking down and where the support is for Tesla as it falls. This is a daily chart, and you can see Tesla's been in the bear market here really since all the way back in May, but most recently it broke through the 200 day moving average and then fell back below it again in uh, late September. So we can see Tesla made a new low here at uh, 204 and 16 cents on looks like on Friday the 14th of October so Tesla's in a bear market it's below the 200 it's below the 20 day it's below the five day moving average there's just no question about it and it's broken past its uh, or below its current support so let's take a look first at the one hour chart I'm going to show you some algorithmically generated prices in a minute but let's take a look at the hourly chart this is a 200 hour blue line a 20 hour red line and we'll take a look and we can see the Tesla broke underneath the 200 hour mark at about the uh, moving average at about the 22nd roughly of September and it's been down there ever since so we're in a deep bear market on an intraday basis but that intraday day basis this is an hourly chart you can it just extends every trading day and you can see it's in a bear market and it's not getting any support now we go take a look at the weekly chart and it doesn't get any better Tesla is in a straight down bear market. You could argue that Tesla is becoming extremely oversold here, but nonetheless, it is where it is. It's broken this support. As I said earlier, this May 206 support has been broken. Friday it closed or, or broke down to 204 and 16. So it's broken this support level and it's now headed to the low 180s. This is $182 here and this is 179. So you, right around the 180 mark, you've got support for Tesla. And that looks to me like what it's going to test. I think Tesla's probably going to get into the 180s and we'll see what happens. If it violates the 180s, it's really bad news because its next support here is the 200 week moving average at 154 ish roughly but I suspect we'll get a bounce in the low 180s but that's probably where we're headed uh, if we don't get a rally this week again this market for Tesla is oversold it's due for a rally but it's just a straight down knife falling and I'm not sure who's going to step in front of it and catch it let's take a look at the one month chart it's a very negative one month chart for Tesla you can see it was above the the 20 month moving average the five month moving average but now that's all the way back here from from uh, you can see from January uh, of 19 uh, excuse me December of 19 but now we have a violation of the five month moving average below the 20 the 20 month moving average is flattened off price the five month is all below the 20 month so the very negative looking chart you can see again it's violated the support so this is not good for Tesla on an hourly, daily, weekly, or monthly basis. Let's go take a look real quick at RVM Research algorithmically generated prices. These are going to be short-term prices for entry of Monday, the 17th of uh, October. Again, these are short-term, one, five, and 20 days looking to buy some dips. We've got buy prices here at 191, 196, 202. These are all for entertainment purposes only. You have to do your own analysis. Basically, you get in here on a Monday, get out worst case Tuesday, same thing. Get in Monday, get out five trading days later, get in Monday, get out 20 trading days later, all these at a loss or take your profits as soon as you get them. So that's how these work. Again, 191, <coughs> excuse me, through 202 for the non-trend following system. Let's go and take a look at our trend following algorithm for generated prices. These are 30 day trend following. Get in Monday the 17th. If your own analysis says it's a good idea, again, these are all for entertainment purposes only. But if your own analysis says it's a good idea, we got a short at Tesla at 226 and change. So that means that the price trades through that that under our system would indicate a short position is viable and uh, your whole period max would be 30 days closed out at a loss if you uh, do not have a profit before then. If you have a profit, you take it as soon as you get it. Again, all for entertainment purposes only. So that's what our prices look like for Monday the 17th. So there you have it. Short-term trading prices from anywhere from 1 to 30 days and then a technical analysis that I gave you earlier with the moving averages. Tesla does not look good and needs some support. If you'd like to get access to all of our entry prices every morning before 7 a.m., they're all available free. No credit card required at rbamresearch.com. We cover 190 stocks, the major forex pairs, BTC crypto and the most liquid futures contracts link in the description below again all free no credit card required and updated by 7 a.m. 
Monday through Friday. Keep in mind, everything you've seen and heard on here is for entertainment purposes only. Can't use it for anything other than entertainment. You should always do your own analysis, and you definitely trade at your own risk. If you like this video, please click the like button. If you want to subscribe, please do that as well. And if you have a great comment for us, we'd love to hear it in the comment section below.